Hello everyone. Welcome to another video of Laura's Places and People. Today we are going to be visiting one of the most beautiful countries on earth and this is Brazil. Brazil is bordered to the west and south by all the countries of South America with the exception of Ecuador and Chile. In the north and east of the country is the Atlantic Ocean. Brazil has a coastline of 7,491 kilometers along the Atlantic Ocean. The country is the fifth largest by area in the world, with a total area of 8,500,000 square kilometers. So to get to know more about this country, Brazil, let's start by having a brief history. As far back as 11,000 years ago, human activity was already existing in the area known as Brazil. In 1494, the Treaty of Tordesillas was signed, where the Portuguese Empire claimed this area, known as Brazil, for itself. On 22nd of April, 1500, Pedro Álvarez Cabral arrives in the area known as Brazil to physically take control of this territory. In 1532, the first settlements were established by the Portuguese, which effectively started the colonization of this area. In 1534, King John III of Portugal divided the area known as Brazil into the 15 private and autonomous captaincy colonies. In the 1550s, the Portuguese started to bring in slaves to establish the sugar plantations and the sugar economy of Brazil was effectively started. In 1807, the Spanish and Napoleonic forces threatened the security of continental Portugal. This caused Prince Regent Joao, in the name of Maria I, to move the royal court from Lisbon to Rio de Janeiro. In 1821, Prince Joao IV lives for Portugal and leaves his young son, Prince Pedro, as the regent king of the Kingdom of Brazil. In 1822, on 7th September, the Kingdom of Brazil becomes independent from the Portuguese Empire. Prince Pedro becomes the first emperor of the Brazilian Kingdom and is referred to as Dom Pedro I. On August 29th, 1825, Portugal recognizes Brazil as an independent kingdom. On 7th April 1831, Dom Pedro I leaves for Portugal to settle his disputes and skirmishes with abolitionists in, the, in Lisbon. He leaves his son, Pedro II, as the king of Brazil. On 15th November 1889, Pedro II was overthrown by a coup, and the Republic of Brazil was declared. Between 1889 and 1989, a series of dictatorships occurred, with the exception of the period between 1956 and 1962. In 1988, Brazil ushered in a new constitution. This was followed by the period of the 1990s, with peace and steady growth. There was a transition of leaders that was peaceful and a new age of industrialization occurred. In the 2000s, there was continued progress in Brazil, which made it the sixth largest economy in the world. Between 2014 to 2022, there has been a series of corruption scandals, a recession, and a change of governments. Today, the population of Brazil is 214 million people. Of these, the white people or the Caucasians make up 103 million, the mixed or the pardo make up 95 million people, the blacks or people of African descent make up 17 million people, people of Asian descent make up 2 million people, and the indigenous or natives make up 1 million people. The largest concentrations of this population is in the cities of Sao Paulo, Rio de Janeiro, Brasilia, 
Salvador, Fortaleza, and Belo Horizonte. The religion in Brazil is diverse. 88% of the country are of Christian faith, with Catholics making up 64%, Protestants making up 22%. 8% of the country claim to have no religion or do not follow any religious faith. 2% practice spiritism and 3% practice other faiths. Brazil is a federal country with 26 states and one federal district. There are 5,570 municipalities. The states of Brazil include Rio de Janeiro, Acre or Eica, Alagoas, Amapá, Amazonas, Bahia, Ceará, the federal district, Espírito Santo, Goiás, Maranhão, Mato Grosso, Mato Grosso do Sol, Minas Gerais, Pará, Paraíba, Paraná, Pernambuco, Piauí, Rio Grande do Norte, Rio Grande do Sol, Rondônia, Roraima, Santa Catarina, Sao Paulo, Sagipe, and Tocantins. The largest of these states is Amazonas, with its capital as Manaus. Amazonas covers an area of 1,559,000 square kilometers. The second largest is Pará, with an area of 1,247,000 square kilometers. The most famous of the states, Rio de Janeiro, covers an area of 43,000 square kilometers, which is equivalent to the state of Denmark. Sao Paulo covers an area of 248,000 square kilometers, which is about the size of Uganda. The most populous states in Brazil are Sao Paulo with 46 million people and Sao Paulo City, its capital, having 12 million people. Minas Gerais has 21 million people. Rio de Janeiro has 17 million people. Bahia has 14 million people. And Paraná has 11 million people. The capital of Brazil is Brasilia. The city is located in the central west region of the country, and it was founded by President Juscelino Kubitschek on 21st April 1960. Brasilia is the third most populous city in Brazil. It is a planned city and was developed by Lucio Costa, Joaquim Cardoso, Oscar Niemeyer in 1956. The city's design divides it into numbered blocks as well as sectors for specified activities such as hotel sector, banking sector and the embassy sector. The city is home to the executive, legislature and judiciary. It also hosts over 100 embassies and the city's airport is the third busiest in Brazil. The city was the host of the 2016 Summer Olympics for some matches and one of the host cities for the 2014 FIFA World Cup. We cannot talk about Brazil without talking about Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo is the most popular city in Brazil with more than 12 million people. It is the most popular city in the Western and Southern Hemispheres and the fourth largest city by population in the world. It has the largest economic contribution to Brazil by GDP. Sao Paulo is a cosmopolitan city with some of the largest populations of Italian, Japanese, Portuguese, Jewish, Arab, and African populations in the Southern Hemisphere. Economically, Sao Paulo is the economic center of Brazil with a contribution of more than $200 billion in GDP to Brazil. Sao Paulo is a large metropolis with the most skyscrapers 
in the world. It also has some of the tallest skyscrapers in Brazil, like Mirante do Valle, Edificio Italia, Banespa, and North Tower. Sao Paulo is also a large cultural hub and hosts several events like the Brazilian Grand Prix, the Sao Paulo Fashion Week, the ATB Brazil Open, the Brazil Game Show, the Sao Paulo Jazz Festival, and the Comic-Con Experience. Another city we cannot ignore in Brazil is Rio de Janeiro. It is the second most popular city in Brazil with 6.7 million people. It is the capital of Rio de Janeiro state. It is the hub of Brazilian tourism with more than 6 million visitors annually. Rio, as it is popularly known, has world-class hotels, more than 80 kilometers of beaches, Sugarloaf Mountains, the Maracanã Stadium, and a thriving nightlife, which are all attractions for tourists. The city is accessible through its airport and a vast network of highways. Make sure you've subscribed and hit the notification bell because we are going to continue with another part of these secrets of Brazil in another video. See you soon.